All right, YouTube, a little bit of a different scenery today, doing a pants review. I know, weird, but these are some awesome pants, so I thought they were worthy of a review. So these are the Condor Cypher. You can see they have the gray, the khaki, and then the black. I bought all these by my own money, guys. I didn't, Condor didn't send these to me. You know, I I saw these announced at, I think it was SHOT Show, and I really wanted to try them out, because let me tell you my biggest complaint. So here you have a pair of... 511 tack light pros right and it screams tactical right i mean and they're meant to be tactical pants but they they're so obvious they have these big cargo pants they have these huge huge boot cut you know just massive with their um just they look tactical my wife absolutely hates them because <laughs> the way how how large the the back area is they just look like tactical pants and sometimes that's great, but other times you don't necessarily want to look like you're wearing tactical pants. You kind of want to blend in. You want to be like the gray, you know, like they say the gray man theory of um, not looking tactical but still being prepared. So these pants feature a lot of the same features as like the Tac Light Pros. Um, I've also got the LA Police Gear version here that I've reviewed in the channel before. And these are great, these are great pants for their entire use, but for everyday use, they're just a little too. I don't know, tactical, I guess you'd say. So, but they have very similar um, features as the tack lights and the police gears, but they are they don't look tactical. Uh, so we'll move the other colors out of the side. We'll just do the gray. So the material is a little different. It's got like a, a, a Teflon coating. It's um, lighter weight, a lot lighter weight than like the, um, we'll just keep the tack light here, than the tack light, but it also has the Teflon coating so it will repel water. Um, but as you can see, in the back here, it's like a standard pair of pants, guys. It just has the two rear pockets. Let me get the camera. There we go. It has the two rear pockets just like a normal pair of pants, right? And on the front, they look like a normal pair of pants. Minus, you do have a little bit of support here on the knees, which we'll talk about here. Um, but, you know, overall... These past, like one guy, I thought I was wearing golf pants, you know, when I was wearing these. So they they blend in. They have kind of your normal pocket cut too. They're not like a crazy um, cut on the pockets like this in the back. You know, they don't have this deep pocket, which has its uses. But and then they have um, a different pocket cut here, just kind of like a normal pair of pants, like a normal pair of slacks or a normal pair of jeans. Um, what's awesome about them, besides the awesome material, is they have a, they have a, a little zipper pocket here for whatever, your phone, whatever you want to put in there. But one of the cool things is, is they have a, um, the pockets here on the side are, are, are what I love. So you, you can't really see them that well. You have your back pocket here, and then you have your side pocket here. And this is designed to carry a, it can fit up to an AR-15 magazine. It also works exceptionally well for a pistol mag. I've got a Glock 19 magazine here. That just goes right in there. You don't even know it's there. It's secure. It stays in there as long as you're not running up, you know, going upside down. So it allows you to carry a spare magazine on you without looking tactical. You can carry a, like the Benchmade sock pee here. I carry this a lot right there. And then I have my shirt covering it. And so you can't even tell um, that I'm carrying that. You can carry a tactical folder. Um, sometimes I carry like a karambit or a, a, cold, or a cold steel towel wire or something like that. So it's got one of those pockets on both sides. One right, that's the back, excuse me. One right there, and then one right there. So on my, on my offhand side, I usually carry a spare magazine, or um, I can't carry a gun at work, so I don't usually carry a spare magazine at work, I carry it in my car, and I usually carry like a, a backup blade, like a defensive folder. Then on this side, I'll carry my other EDC knife. Like, you know, I can clip it there, um, or I can just drop it in that pocket. It's very discreet, so it doesn't look like you're even carrying a knife. Um, because this is mostly covered by your shirt and you know sometimes people will see this part of your pocket at the front and then they'll see a knife clip or something and then in the other pocket i usually carry my flashlight i do carry a flashlight there but other than that i mean they're pretty much your basic pair of pants they're also cut um more slim now they're not skinny jeans by any way shape or form so let's look at the the leg here so you can see here that's how wide it is now compare that let's see if i'm in frame there Compare that to the 511, and you're going to see how much wider 
the 511 is. I mean, you can't even see the pant. That's actually the other leg. So here's a good comparison right there. You can see that the 511 has a good, I don't know, quarter inch or more of material and just makes the pant much more wider and just not, I just don't think they look nearly as good. So the ciphers are awesome, guys. I've got three pair of these things because they're about 40 bucks. They're, they've got this nice um, elastic part right here for your carry gun. So when you're carrying, you're not, you're not gonna, it's gonna stretch a little bit. The fabric is, let's see, it's, that's machine wash. That's your machine. So good, you know, good to know on the, on the instructions there. Machine wash, cold. Um, I've, I've washed these a few times without any issues. They do run true to size. I wear 3430 most of my pants. They're actually, they might be a titch big, but I have lost a good amount of weight recently. I lost about 12 pounds, so that might be why. Um, so I just think they're really good pants. They are they look more normal. Um, you can wear them. I wear these to work. These are like my work pants. I have to wear kind of like a business casual. And that's what I, why I got these, because I can wear them to work, but I can also wear them outside of work, and they look like normal pants, and they just don't scream tactical. And that's what's so great about them. So they also have a pair of jeans that I'm going to review in a separate video, I think. Um, go over those as well. Um, I got, I've actually, I'm actually wearing them right now. Maybe I'll just tie it into this video here in a second. But 40 bucks comes in three different colors. Really good, really well made, really good stitching. Um, I haven't had any problems with these guys. I've been wearing them for a few weeks now. You can see there, um, some of the stitching here on the cuffs. The nice thing is they are, they can be used. They have a gusted crotch. So you can really get down uh, in a, like a shooting stance or some sort of stance and you have no problem. So you could use these as um, tactical pants as well. Um, I feel like they're more for everyday use, you know, EDC type stuff. Um, but they're, they're awesome. So again, they come in the khaki and black and they pass as, as slacks, guys. They, they work as dress slacks. They also work good with, you know, just your everyday carry. Everyday, um, everyday carry, I'll say that everyday um, wardrobe or whatever you're going to wear. So they're greaming, they don't look tactical, they don't scream, wearing tactical pants, so I'm probably carrying a gun. It's the exact opposite. They look like they blend in, they're normal, but they have awesome features like the two rear pockets, one for a spare mag, one for a knife, one for a flashlight. You know, you can put whatever in there, you can even put an AR-15 mags in there. So and then they have the zipper pocket here, and the slimmer cut is one of the things that really uh, appealed to me on these pants. So. That's kind of a the uh, Condor Cipher, we'll call it slack. Um, we'll, we'll talk now about the uh, jeans. All right, guys, so here's the jeans. <laughs> this is one of the colors they offer. This is the indigo. They also have like what they call black blue. Um, but I, I, I'm going to about to order these those other ones, actually. I want to try these out. So essentially, they're the same as the Cipher pant. They have the same side pockets here, the same um, elastic right here for your concealed carry. Um, just kind of to stretch out your pants a little bit. Same kind of freedom of movement, um, but they're a little heavier because they're denim. They do not have the little zipper pocket in the front, obviously. And as you can see, they look like a standard pair of jeans. I mean, there's nothing fancy about them. They look like jeans. And, but they have those extra cool features of those extra pockets. And one of the things that I've always had an issue with, with jeans, here's a good example, some Levi's 514s. See that right there? That's called carrying a knife every day. Um, another one. Another example, another pair of Levi's, Levi's brand, destroyed. Okay, so these do not have, one thing I wish these had, that they don't, is they don't have a reinforcement on the pocket right here. You can see I've been carrying a knife there uh, for the last couple days. Now, I feel like it's it's sturdier than the other jeans. It's heavier duty right there. But um, the nice thing is, bam, you clip it back here or you throw it in this pocket and you don't destroy your front. And again, it doesn't even look like you're carrying a knife. So I wish they would have reinforced that, but not a deal breaker because I have that extra pocket right there. I can still carry a spare mag in one and then my knife, my EDC knife in the other or um, vice versa. So I'm going to I'm gonna put these on with my gun so you can kind of see. But one of my favorite things about these is this stretchy fabric right there that allows you to, it just makes it more comfortable to carry your, your gun. It's just really nice. Other than that, they're just really good looking jeans. I mean, they're just kind of got that classic... Um, jean look to them but they have that you know again that grayman um type um mentality where you know you don't want to look like you're tactical but you're still prepared you still you know have those extra features to carry a spare magazine so they're very much designed around concealed carry and edc um which i really like so 
I'm going to put them on, kind of just kind of show you how they look on. I, it's a 3430 is the size I wear. So you kind of get an idea for the fit. Um, I'll do the same thing for the slacks in the next segment, and then we'll wrap up the video. Okay, so here's the, uh, the uh, slacks, the cypher pants. These are the black, and just kind of an idea how I load it out. You can see my, my firearm here carries really nicely in these. I've got my uh, knife in this pocket. Uh, really nothing in that pocket. Probably got my phone or something. Got a flashlight here, and then a, just a folding caramba here on this side, and then it just kind of give you an idea what they look like all around. All right, so lost my camera, man, for this part. Here's the jeans. Just kind of give you an idea what they look like. Just a normal pair of jeans, really. Fire in there. I've got my ZT-0900 in here. Nothing in there. I'll use the care wallet, you know, stuff like that. The other side pocket, um, I've got my Benjamin Sock P, you can see. Conceals really nicely, sits right on there. And I have a spare Glock mate. That made it in the back pocket on accident. <laughs> But I actually have room for the 19 magazine and the sock P if I want. I don't they're, typically wouldn't do that. I would probably carry the sock P in my back pocket and just have the spare mag in there. But just to give you an idea what the jeans look like on, and they're really nice. And for 40 bucks, you can't go wrong. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap up my video on the Cipher, the Condor Cipher jeans and pants. Um, I think they're awesome. I am was super excited when I heard about them at Shot Show, and obviously when they came out, I bought a couple pair, <laughs> three pair of the pants, I can wear them to work, they're very versatile, and I'm going to get another pair of the jeans, and they just, they're just great I, uh, alternative to like the tab gear jeans that are like $125 a piece, I mean, I know 511's working on something too, and when those come out, I'll probably grab a pair of those just to review and compare them to the Condor, but the Condor beat them out to the market, and I think they're going to sell like crazy guys, because they're just pretty much normal everyday clothes, like a normal guy would wear, but you have the ability to be prepared and carry your extra, you know, extra gear like spare magazines, knives, flashlights and stuff and do it in a pretty discreet manner and not look like you're super tactical. So I really like them. I uh, really, really um, give them two thumbs up, enthusiastic. And I'll put a link in the description where I bought my jeans and where I bought my pants and um, both great vendors to work with. So thanks a lot guys and we'll see you on the next video.